Hi, I'm Mike Streeter with Visonic, and we're going to discuss a little bit about the PERS industry and the products to fulfill that need. Uh, the PERS industry, as of late, is becoming a more and more marketable uh, business segment because of today's baby boomers are coming like a tidal wave, and there's less space for uh, elderly, for assisted living facilities, hospitals, and the like. So what is needed is a product to keep the people where they want to be in their home. So what Visonic has introduced is the Amber line of PERS systems. Uh, introduced several years ago, the Amber X or Amber Select product is the, basically the Cadillac of all PERS products. Not necessarily a button in the box, but a full solution of products for personal emergency response. Not just a pendant, but a pendant that's waterproof, fully supervised, and a, a system that can adapt with the needs of the people as their uh, needs progress and their lifestyle change. You can add a variety of different transmitters per the, for the system, from emergency res, uh, response uh, buttons, flood detection, uh, inactivity sensors such as motion detectors and door and window contacts, um, reminders, you can have customized reminders up to 16 for medication, health tests, wake up calls, and the like. Um, there's speed dial buttons on the unit. The buttons can be pressed to answer incoming phone calls. Um, so it makes the elderly, the person in need, uh, very comfortable within the home themselves. Uh, the Amber X has been a very good se uh, seller for Visonic. And just recently we introduced the Amber Link, which is a little bit lesser functionality product, but still very capable. Uh, utilizes the pendants as well. You can learn up to 28 uh, devices into it. But the nice thing with the Amber Link is where there's no phone line present, you can add a GSM module into it and, and utilize the two-way voice uh, emergency transmission via the cellular network. So this day and age where everybody seems to be ridding themselves of the POTS lines, uh, we now have a solution for this industry, for the uh, baby boomers to still have a personal emergency response system without a POTS line utilizing the Amber Link product. The Amber X unit is the full featured product line that has inactivity, has reminder capabilities, has speed dial capabilities to uh, dial to uh, loved ones and answers two-way voice communication via the pendant or a push button on the console. But one of the most unique features is that it can utilize the MCT241 fall detector. Now the fall detector is a waterproof transmitter that has uh, a button on the surface so you can press it for emergency uh, transmission immediately, but it also has a unique tilt switch. This tilt switch, once it goes 60 degrees past vertical, will transmit to the Amber X unit and announce the user has fallen. What's nice about the unit is it's fully programmable, so I can re uh, program the amount of time between the message repeats and the amount of message repeats. So for instance, I'm wearing this device and I just happen to lean back in my Lazy Boy. Well, I lean back and it goes 60 degrees past vertical, the unit will announce user has fallen. I may not hear it because I have my TV on, but I have it programmed or somebody programmed it for me that it has three message repeats every 20 seconds. So after 20 seconds, I hear now, I hear it because it got louder, user has fallen. Well, I haven't fallen, but I notice that yes, I'm actually leaning back. So I adjust it upward, it will then transmit back to the Amber X unit that user is okay and it never dials out again. But say mom falls on the ground, she hurts herself, she's down for the count, say 20 seconds. It announces user's fallen. It says it again, user's fallen. Now after 80 seconds, 90 seconds, where I have it programmed, it will then dial out to the outside world and help is summons. The advantage of the tilt switch versus some of the other fall detectors on the market is it does not have an accelerometer. It has a tilt switch. And I can control that through the software, the amount of messages, repeats, in the time frame between those message repeats. An accelerometer needs to see a person falling rapidly and stop. Real world, 
the elderly don't fall like that. They usually crumple to a chair or to a bed and then to the ground, so there's no immediate stop. So the MCT-241 is a more reliable uh, source for fall detection. Again, waterproof. It comes with a little not-in-use stand, so when it's not in use, I can take it off at night, put it on the bedside, and it, it's and be good for the next day. Or I can take the belt clip, which I can put on a belt or a pocket, or even strap it to a walker, and utilize a lanyard, and I can wear it around the neck. That way, if I'm doing dishes or I'm bending over to pick up something, it's still in that vertical plane. But the MCT-241 waterproof fall detector is a fantastic add-on for today's seniors.